We've all heard the old adage, what doesn't break you makes you stronger, and that certainly describes SIU football. They went through a lot this spring. They went through COVID-19 protocols. They had limited practices for week one due to a snowstorm. They battled injuries. They were down to their third string quarterback. Then they had teams opt out, had to find new opponents, and it took the last weekend just to get into the playoffs as an at-large bid. And last night, they had the number one seeded team in the playoffs on the ropes. Coach Hill couldn't be more proud of this team. We've played 10 games, nine of them against ranked teams. We've played five top five teams. We've played the number one team um, three times uh, or twice now, North Dakota State, South Dakota State. Weber was ranked number one at times, unbeaten. These guys don't flinch. And we are physical as hell. I, I think, I mean, we're not a team you want to play. We're not a team you want to play. Um, up front, man, man, we, uh, we bring it. Defensively, dudes like Jordan Burner, man, we got dogs, dude. I think we're big fish. We're here to stay. We have a ton of fifth-year seniors that are coming back. We'll probably have the most sixth-year seniors. Out of, I, I don't know who would have more, but we're going to have, you know, 12 or 13 six-year seniors coming back to play next year. All our guys are fired up. I think those guys are hungry as well as me, and uh, we just want to get back at the get back out there as quick as possible. I don't think any of us want to go on vacation, or not vacation, but home on break. Man, we want to come back and get to work. As you heard from the Salukis, they're not going to shy away from anyone. In fact, they believe everyone's got them on the radar because they are not a team to sleep on, and they think this fall could be very special. Reporting from South Dakota, Jason Hurst, News 3 Sports.